yesterday, KFC dropped their brand new Cheetos crispy chicken sandwich. And if you're looking for a cheat day splurge this summer, Colonel Sanders and Chester the Cheeto are serving you comfort food fusion with a new Cheetos sandwich. Dude, 11 year old Sean Ely right now yeah. would be like, they made my thing. Dude, I came up with that. Dude. <laughs> 25 year old super stoned Corey Wagner thinking the same thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 11 year old Sean and 25 year old Corey are the same person. Um, so we're filming this on Monday. You're seeing this on Tuesday. We're getting it done quick. So let's head to KFC for something that only drunk stoners and sober people alike will probably agree is fantastic. Only everyone in the world will agree. We're all joining hands in this conundrum of a sentence that I have failed to stop talking in. Bye! Two Cheetos crispy chicken sandwiches from KFC have been acquired. Jump cut. Where did I put you? Where did I put you? Let's go ahead and put this on my steering wheel here. Okay. All right, so this is a second angle of the Cheetos crispy chicken sandwich. Now out at KFC. This is day two. Go for it. All right, let's see. Open it up, terrifying face. The first thing you see right off the bat. It's an old racist looking man. <laughs> They open her up. Sorry, KFC, that was a joke. Uh, here we go, here's the glory. Pop open the bun. First off, giant, giant piece of chicken for the chicken sandwich. Looks like it's got some sort of sauce on it. It must be some sort of Cheeto sauce, I yeah, suppose. Yeah, yeah. And then under that, there it is. Cheetos and mayonnaise, bro. <laughs> this, happy birthday, America. This is it. This is it right here, dude. This is such an American gross thing. Man, imagine living in a state where recreational marijuana is legal and then getting the mow on this. Hey, your wish is about to be <laughs> our state's command. Jan 1, baby, the 11th state. I don't, am I pro or con of it? I don't know. Do you have any clue how much this was? With tax, it was about 10 bucks. I think it was 470 a person or something, or a sandwich or something like that. Okay, so here's mine. Uh, I got about four or five Cheetos down there. Got this nice piece sticking out here. Looks pretty fun. I'm excited to get down on this. All right, <laughs> here we go. About to stain our insides. Yeah, we sure are. <laughs> Cheetos chicken sandwich from KFC. Cheers. Cheers. First bite, all chicken, no Cheeto. Of course, good. Their chicken is really good. Their chicken no. is really good. That's a no brainer. Now, here's what I'm curious mm. about. When do you eat this? When you're high. So, like, it's a Tuesday at noon, right? Mm -hmm. <sighs> Gotta get out of the office. I'm gonna go walk around. Maybe I'll stop at the KFC and head back into the office. Is this too insane to eat during a work day? It's, it's actually kind of light, it's not huge. No, because it's only like four or five Cheetos. Right. I like it, it's it's a good airiness. It but is. It's still a crunch. I like the crunch, that's the thing, I like the texture of like the crunchy chicken and then also the crunchy Cheetos. And it really does give that Cheeto flavor, I mean, mm -hmm. it comes across, it's not hidden. Sometimes you'll put something on a sandwich and it'll be hidden by the sandwich. Right. Not this one. Oh. I have a surprise for you. So because this is something that I feel like brings me back to how much I used to like Cheetos growing up. I don't eat a lot yeah. of Cheetos anymore because of all the hate I have for myself after oh, I eat yeah. them. I brought us something to wash it down with. Oh, yeah. This is Mountain Cooler mm. Capri Sun. I thought maybe, you know what, today was a great day for it. I love a good Capri Sun. And Thank it's, you. It's 90 degrees out, so yeah. I'm like, you know what? Stab it right in there. Yeah. Oh, wow. Did they get better? At they got better. I think they, they took all their criticisms about their tops. Yeah, this used to be a challenge when I was a child. Or maybe I was That's a challenged true. child. I was at the grocery store today and I was like, I'm gonna get Corey a little surprise. Man, I do not remember these straws being so thin that you can only get a minimal amount. You know what the trick is? You gotta squeeze it. It's like shotgunning or something. You gotta squeeze the liquid, oh, uh, squeeze the pouch. Mm -hmm. You're gonna be done with yours before I get the straw in mine. And it forces it all into your, into your <clears throat> gullet, you know? I think I just accidentally bit off some of the plastic straw and ate it. Oh man, that Capri Sun hit the spot. Right? Yeah. In 2021, I'll have mine open and I'll get to share it with <laughs> you. My hands are so slippery. My favorite part of this. Whoa! Uh, my favorite part of this chicken sandwich so far is how the bottom bun uh, got stained in Cheeto, mm -hmm. and it looks like I bludgeoned someone to death with the bottom of my sandwich. 
There's a bar in Chicago I want to take you to that makes boozy Capri Suns. Mmm, that's probably good. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. This is really good. It's surprisingly good. The one downside of the sandwich is, I don't know how you can eat this and not feel like just a piece of human trash. <laughs> like, I think if you live in a two bedroom house and you buy this, they kick you out. They put you in a trailer. You're, you don't have, you can't stay where you live, dog. They make it kick you, evict you? They evict you and they put you in a trailer. Like, you go where you belong. I'm surprised this doesn't come with a two liter Mountain Dew. <laughs> what would be that like gift bag? Be one of these, a two liter Mountain Dew, proactive acne medication. Yeah, and then they take all the condoms out of your wallet <laughs> and say, you're, you're good, you don't, you're good. You don't gotta worry, kid. Carpo tunnel from all the masturbating and video gaming, probably. Were you a very pimply kid? No, I got kind of lucky. Me too. That was one of the ones I never really had like a outbreak. Uh -huh. But if I got one, it'd be like a decent size. Right. But then it would go away. Right. But I wasn't, no, I never, I got really lucky because I feel like that would probably be embarrassing and suck. It would probably not fun to. I just uh, did the whole Oprah, um, the secret mentality where you just will everything into existence. So I just go, I don't want acne. I really believed it and I never got it. I'm trying to figure out how you know all that stuff about Oprah. I never heard that. That's a thing about her? That was like her big book. It was called The Secret. And you read it? No. Oh. And her entire basis of how she got successful was just willing things. If you believe it, it will happen. Hmm. But then people were like, okay. So I just go, I want to be a millionaire. <laughs> like, oh, you got to work too, though. Yeah. Um, I'm not going to lie to you, dude. I was excited to have that, but assumed it would somehow the novelty would make it suck like yeah it'd be too much or like it was just too much of a like a gag thing mm -hmm. and it wasn't because no. it's only five cheetos it's just enough because you have enough of that processed cheese and it's, your body starts yeah, to shut yeah. down yeah i agree it was like just a minimal amount was the right amount put a few more on there and it could have tasted like trash city you know and nobody wants to visit trash nobody city. wants to visit trash city uh-uh you know who's the queen of Trash City? Who? Kylie Hayes. His fiance. <laughs> um, I was gonna quiz you, but I can't even find the answer. I was gonna say, down to the tenth, how many ounces is this? Because it feels about an ounce and a half of yeah. liquid. I like how they never wavered. Same really 90s, like, oh, yeah. uh, just apples splashing through water. Capri Sun. Liquid cool. Um, all right, before we rate that, I think today we do some shirt shout outs. Yeah, let's do a couple shirt shout outs. Shirt, shirt shout out, shout shirt shout out, shirt shout out. People that want shirts, keep in mind, if you are in the mood to be escalated, to have your name said immediately, there is a, a, a way to do that. You buy yep, multiple right. items out of the store and then you jump the line. You're like Mario getting a, 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 a mushroom. No. Oh. Mar Mario doesn't get a mushroom and jump the line. Mario goes in tubes and then the mm. tubes, the tubes, <laughs> the tubes will take him to other levels that are in the future. Mo the mushroom makes him bigger. Go in that green tube. Get in the tube. Go to the front. Skip the line. Shirt shout out number one. Ian Martin, Hong Kong. Wow. That shirt travel, not shirt, those shirts. That No, that's not true. The shirt, the jump cut shirt, and a sticker sheet went all the way to Hong Kong. Which is amazing. It left him. your apartment and went to Hong Kong. Wow. That's crazy. That's crazy. Ian, thank you. And a big shout out to Jamie Redfield for buying a burger shirt. Which is awesome, the pocket shirt. Yeah. And uh, stickers. She got four stickers. Yeah. I wonder where she put them. I don't know. Maybe or a laptop. He. I have a guy cousin named Jamie. I think it is a guy. Okay, yeah. I actually have a, no idea. I, I, my guy cousin Jamie, I remember in uh, fourth grade, he goes, I was like, What's up, Jamie? And he goes, Actually, it's, uh, I'm doing James now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was a big moment for me. <laughs> uh, if you guys want to jump the line, number 6 cheesecom buy two things out of the store. It can be a shirt and a shirt, shirt and sticker, shirt and a koozie, a koozie and stickers. It doesn't matter. Do what you do. It could literally be as cheap as what? Like 15 bucks. Yep. So there you go. All right. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for to decide whether or not you should yourself go out and purchase this sandwich. Based on what we say, do what you want with this information. Out of five cool looking sunglasses that Chester the Cheetah might wear. How many cool looking sunglasses that Chester the Cheetah might wear do you give the Cheetos crispy chicken sandwich from KFC, brand new this week, Corey? All right, so here's what I'm thinking. I love innovation, and I feel like they innovated. 
I love genius marketing moves, and I think they made a really smart marketing move because a bag of Cheetos has a lot of Cheetos in them, and they're only using four, so the cost per Cheeto has got to be low. Like it was yeah. very minimal cost to make a, a new sandwich that essentially is just the same sandwich with some Cheetos on it. That's a pretty brilliant marketing move. So I love the marketing move. I love that they're willing to innovate and try new things. The uh, KFC chicken sandwich is just gonna be amazing. It just is what it is. I know. So you add something like that little bit of sauce and that little bit of Cheetos and it just really brings the flavor out just a little bit. That was excellent. That was really, really... <laughs> that was really good stuff. All that combined, I'm not even a big Cheeto flavor guy. Yeah. So if you're not a big Cheeto flavor guy, maybe it's not for you. But I loved it and I love the innovation. I love the marketing idea. I'm gonna give that a 4.75. Wow, that's a great score. It was great. It was. The, I just don't like Cheeto flavor, so it was. A, I couldn't give it that full five because I wouldn't love that flavor again. You right. know, it was worth an experience. That's for sure. I would definitely try it. It's nice that you're done eating that and you don't have any. That's, a, that's the best part, maybe. We almost got killed by a bus. That's why we stopped. Yep. <laughs> um, are you more of a Cheetos, like the traditional crunchy ones? Or are you like poofs? Not the poofs. Okay. And that I, was a poof one, right? Those were not poofs. I like the crunchy better. I like My favorite is Flamin' Hot Cheetos Crunchy, like the traditional flavor. Yeah, I feel like those are crunchier than what we just had even. Because hmm. maybe the, those feel smaller. They were a little soggy too, being in a bunch of mayo. Yeah, that might have been it. Anyways, I'm going to give it a 4.5. <laughs> I thought it was really great. Um, I think like when you see that sandwich in the really intimidating photo like online, it looks like this big monstrous sandwich. And not that you really need it to be huge, but like, I don't know, I think that I would like that to that be, would... I thought it was like, that was like a good medium sized sandwich. I want, I kind of want like a monstrosity what Cheeto sandwich. What in the world I are want... you talking about, bro? Mm. Bro, give me, let me find this guy. You're lucky I ate almost my whole chicken. Is this <laughs> one like mine? That. You didn't think that chicken sandwich was big enough? I thought it was a good medium, like medium, like bigger than average for sure. But I want that, I want to see that thing like it's a fucking. it barely fits in my hand. That's what I want, I'm a fatty. What are you, you want a bigger piece of chicken on that? Bro, I, I can't wait. I want the sandwich to be bigger. Like that just looks like it'd be massive. Doesn't it? But that chicken was, bro, don't. Chicken was Whatever good. he just said, I'm sorry I have to do this to you, do not listen to him. That, what, is, that, what are they listening to? The first, thing I, the first thing I opened up, I right. said, dang, that's a big piece of chicken meat. <laughs> Pop open the bun. First off, giant, giant piece of chicken for the chicken sandwich. <laughs> that right. piece of chicken, that's about as big of a chicken filet as you can get on a sandwich. You want bigger chicken meat than that? You want just two chicken breasts on there? Yeah. <laughs> Don't listen to him. That chicken breast was massive, dog. Don't listen to that. It was really, really good. I was really happy we got that. We'll That's see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video. World we live in. Thank you so yeah. much for watching. Uh, tomorrow, I think we have a cool Jets Pizza video. So, if that's true, enjoy that video. And if you are a Patreon member who is getting early access, that's up on Patreon now. Go watch it. Jets likes people that comment. All right, bye. Yeah.